So I'm going to do a song now um, that was actually inspired by the person right next to me. Um, really? Really? We, you know, as songwriters, we're always looking, you know, inspirations all around us. And sometimes, you know, sometimes you listen to, I'm just looking for something to write about. And, and we, uh, Abe was one of my best friends in the whole world. Maybe the best. Lucky. And um, we were sitting around, and what, something came up with a, with, a, with a comment about nice guys finishing last. She's like, oh yeah, she wrote a song about like that. And I was like, okay, well, nice guys finishing last. And I wasn't looking for things, inspiring words and, and phrases and things that might kind of, you know, get this get this message across about the nice guys finishing last. And one of the, the, the place that I found the inspiration was in the Bible. Now, I'm not gonna say that when I say that, it might be like, oh my God, he's just a religious guy. And I mean, actually, I'm, I'm, I consider myself spiritual, not necessarily religious in the, in the traditional sense. And I, uh, and I look for inspiration wherever, wherever I can, you know. And, uh, and this just happened to be in this case in the Bible. There's this famous saying, you know, for the last shall be the first and the first shall be the last, right? Which kind of twists the meaning of what we, what we, uh, what we were talking about. And so I took that and made this song. It's called Last One in Line. Simply by design, should be the last one in line. 